We have two elementary schools, one here in Medical Lake, the town proper, and one out on Fairchild Air Force Base. We have one middle school and we have one high school, grades 9-12, and we have an alternative program. I would say that the shift to Common Core and these standards has truly put an intentional focus on the teaching and the learning and the instructional opportunities we're offering our students every single day. I believe that the key to our success in the development of our curriculum maps as well as our standards-based report card was the fact that we were able to bring the teachers from each grade level in both buildings together and work collaboratively. The teachers were able to walk away with a common understanding of the expectations of their students as well as the standards. My school district has been phenomenal in providing support and resources for the Common Core. They see the value of it, they know it's important, and they have been willing to support attending training, having time to work together, you know, to brainstorm ideas and, and communicate across grade levels. As a freshman teacher, I want to make sure that my students are to a standard where the sophomore teacher needs them to be, and the junior teacher, and the senior teacher. We don't want students to get to the senior level and be lacking in all the skills. So we want to support each other. Maybe parents just weren't aware, but we've always had standards that we had to teach to. So I don't think using the Common Core standards takes away creativity. If anything, digging deeper into each topic gives you more of a chance to do that. And I have also seen in students' responses, as they're learning to explain their work, sometimes their answers are so creative, they come up with explanations that I have never thought of before. One thing that I like about Common Core is that it's research-based and I know that Common Core is what the businesses are looking for, what college is looking for. Okay, so the standards aren't new, the standards are just more specific than they used to be. And right now we're battling a lot in the media and perception as, a, as we see the data start coming in. I think that's when it'll start picking up steam and being more accepted. The Common Core standards for a student are more realistic, lifetime, lifelong learning skills. These are the skills that make kids successful for college and career. It sets a bar high and it helps step by step for kids to reach that bar you know, every year, building towards graduation and being ready for college. Transitions are difficult for students no matter when or where they occur um, or how often. And this gives us an opportunity to really be on a similar playing field for all students. One advantage for our large military population is with Common Core standards there, basically nationwide. So when a student moves from Kansas or from Texas to here, they should be working on the same standards, the same things that they were working on at their old school. Students need to be a part of their education. It's something done with them, not something done to them. Our motto is every student, every day. And so we're gonna do everything in our power to make sure that every student every day receives the quality education that they deserve.